Under the stewardship of Wayne and Susan Krecklow, family came first. But surprisingly, when it came to the recruitment of Molly Taylor, maiden name Krecklow, and Wayne's niece, that was not the case. I started getting all this recognition and, and they said, you know, we, we didn't really want to recruit family, um, but it would be stupid of us not to. It was funny, when I actually committed, I said, you know, I don't even know if you've offered me a scholarship, but I'd like to play for you. It's one of the best decisions the three of them ever made. Molly grew into one of the top players in program history, the first Mizzou volleyball player to ever win a Conference Player of the Year award. I think as my career advanced, my, my role changed a lot. The volleyball stuff I always had down pretty well. I, I love to work hard and I love to get extra reps and be the best that I could be, but to, to make sure the team was coming together and that was my responsibility was a big challenge. But it's a challenge Molly conquered. The same season she was named SEC Player of the Year, Mizzou Volleyball went on an amazing 35-0 run as she led the Tigers to the first team championship for the school in any sport in Mizzou's new home of the SEC. Every time we stepped on the court, I think we took a lot of pride in playing our best and what can go wrong when you're not losing. I think we had over 8,000 fans here that night. It was pretty cool. The confetti, you know, the stage, all that stuff. I still have people that will see us me around town and be like, oh, you were on that SEC championship team. And she's still around town because Molly Krecklow is now Molly Taylor. She met her husband, Josh, when both played for the United States national team and now they coach side by side in Columbia. Josh as the head coach, Molly his top assistant. She helps lead the same program she played for. I feel very fortunate to even still be here. I think Mizzou is a really special place in general, but I think for me, of course, it's been home for me for a long time and it still is. And I'm just really grateful that they considered me um, a Hall of Famer. I think that's, yeah, it's weird to say. <laughs>